gonna use is acrylic paints, but if you wanna use your nail polish, feel free to do so. You're also gonna need a small brush, sponge, nail polish, a black one and a sparkly one. And start by applying your yellow polish. We're going to create your yellow polish or acrylic paint to create that beautiful gradient of fire. So I'm just gently dabbing on the yellow and then I'm gonna mix a little bit of the yellow and the orange to kind of create the next light color. And then I'm just gonna pile to the next and apply on the darker orange color. And the darkest one is just the red one. And you can just create colors in between, like mix the red with the orange and just place it in between so there's a very smooth, beautiful gradient. So now apply your sparkly glitter nail polish and I would suggest using um, a nail polish that is see-through. Don't use some really chunky, really um, opaque glitter because it's going to kind of ruin your design. And this is going to make your fire sparkle. <laughs> So now the fun part, take your thin strip nail polish, black nail polish, and outline the fire. And you can do it starting from the tip, you can do it from the opposite direction. I like, I like it looking like it's the fire starting from the beginning of my nail opposed to the tip. So I'm just outlining the fire and then filling it in at the tip. And I don't know if this is the actual Katniss design in the movie, but um, I decided to give it a shot. This is how I imagined it, and I hope you like it. And if you're not reading the books, you totally should. They're absolutely incredible. It's an incredible adventure. I'm like freaking out about the movie. And now we're gonna create the um, Mockingjay. So I'm just lightly outlining a circle with white. And I'm also using the acrylic paints. You can also use uh, a white polish. I would really suggest the acrylic paints because if you mess up, you can just wipe it off. And now I'm going to draw on the wings. And if you follow these exact steps, you're actually going to find it easy to draw the bird. And you can also practice on a piece of paper before putting it on your nail so you kind of study the shape of it. So now that I'm done outlining it with white, I'm going to fill it in with the lightest yellow and I just kind of mix a little bit of yellow, a little bit of white so it's not too bright. You try to run, you try to and I'm going to do a little bit of the shading so I mix a little white, a little black and a little red so just kind of that brown, yellow, um, dark yellow color. So I'm creating a little bit, giving a little bit of a pop, just some 3D effect. And it's not going to look perfect because the, the design is so small, but it already looks like something. So I really like it. And then take your um, black nail polish again and start all light, outlining where you went a little overboard with the paint. So there's nothing you, can, you can't fix. You just go and color it over. And if you messed up, then take again and do it again. So finish up with the top coat and you're all finished. Don't forget to subscribe, I have a lot of good tutorials. Bye!